I'm going to show you a technique used to make the jasmine scarf. Um, I have a small swatch here with just a single repeat right in the middle. I'm going to start on the wrong side. Um, but for the wrong side row, the first thing you do is purl six stitches. So let's do that real quick. Um, after you purl these six stitches, the pattern says to purl one, wrapping the yarn twice. That's six, two, four, six, yes. So to do that, you purl um, normally, wrap it once, and then you just wrap it one more time, just like that. Then the pattern tells you to purl eight. So we're gonna do that. Two. Eight, all right. And then once again, it says purl one, wrapping the yarn twice. Here's that step again. Wrap it once. Wrap it twice. Since I only have a single repeat on my swatch, I'm going to go ahead and just purl to the end of my row now. On the right side, you start out by knitting six stitches. So I'll do that. One, two. Um, once you've knit those six stitches, you're going to come to your um, twice wrap stitch. So what you're going to do is just let that stitch fall off the tip of this needle to the front of your work. Just like that. Then you're going to knit four. Once you've knit four, you're going to look for that drop stitch and pick it up with your left needle and then knit it just like that then you slip the next four stitches purlwise keeping your working yarn in the back so that's one two three four at this point you reach your next twice wrap stitch once again we're going to just let it fall off the tip of the needle to the front of the work now we're going to slip those same four stitches back over to the left. We're going to pick up the drop stitch with your right needle and put it on your tip of your left needle. And now it's ready to knit. There we go. Just like that. Um, once again, I just have one repeat on my swatch. So I'm going to go ahead and knit to the end of my row. Um, that's all I've got to show you today for the jasmine scarf.